this is a different style of video. Today, I am building Bellacor. One model, two sprues, 86 parts. Before starting Bellacor proper, we first need to construct his scenic base. Here we have our first option, to place either a slain Chaos Warrior or a Space Marine on the base. Since this model will be used in 40k, we're going with the Space Marine, using parts 17 through 20. With the Space Marine in place, we can move on to the finishing touches. What we're left with is a dynamic base with a strong narrative flair. Next we're moving on to the big guy himself.
Here we have another build option, with his arm either raised or his arm at his side. This is all based on which chest you choose, part 23 or 48 respectively. For this build, I'm opting for part 23, pointing forward, evoking Bellacor's older model. The last option of the core body for Bellacore offers a few face variations, either teeth clenched, part 60, mouth open, parts 56 and 57, or tongue out, parts 58 and 59. I'll be using the bared teeth, part 60. Regardless of which you choose, they all attach to Bellacore's crown. At this point, he's ready to be attached to his base. For painting enthusiasts, I would recommend keeping these parts separate in sub-assemblies, or using a minimal amount of glue, as there may be some hard-to-reach areas if he is securely glued onto his scenic base. Next, we're moving on to the wings. Thank you. 
Each wing has an option on one of its trophy chains. Like with the slain character on the base, these are options either suited for Fantasy, parts 72 and 85, or 40k, with parts 73 and 86. Like with the previous, I'll be assembling the 40k options. And now it's time to finally attach his wings. You want a good amount of glue for a piece of this heft, but be sure not to overload the surface, as you don't want glue running down your model and melting any details. And with the wings in place, Bellacor is looking pretty fierce and ready for some paint. Overall, I'd say the model was a breeze to put together, and was quite fun, as most large centerpiece characters tend to be. Thanks for watching this Velocore build guide. This was another venture experimenting with new styles of content. Audio foibles and framing mistakes aside, I found it to be enjoyable to put together. So if you found it useful or enjoyed it, and would like to see more content in this style, please let me know in the comments. Anyways, there are buttons you can press for liking, sharing, and subscribing. So press the buttons you want to press, and I'll catch you in the next one.